time in history, all four belts in the cruiserweight division will belong proudly around the waist of one man. One of the biggest fights of the year, unquestionably, the IBF featherweight title fight, Lee Selby, defending his title for the fifth time against the local hero, Josh Warrington. It really has got all the ingredients. Josh, Elland Road, he says as he looks him right in the eye, being here, having this fight, is part of a dream, isn't it? Listen, John, destiny is taking its toll. Destiny is involved in front of us. I don't think there's not that Lee can do. This is just, I'm meant to win the world title on May 19th for Ellen Road and that's it. What do you think of Josh as a fighter? I respect him, just like any other fighter. You say, you say there that you've you respected me. In the early days when the rival was building, when I first met you all them years ago, we shook hands and, you know, I, you seemed a bit timid about wanting to shake hands. I respected you from, from that day because you'd, you'd achieved everything. You did know from then on and downplayed any of my achievements. Anytime you got asked, about performances and whatnot. Don't get me wrong, I've had some uh, when I've been my best at the office, but there's been times when you just easy work or oh, knock him out, not at my level. And then a few months later, you turn that tide around and then, yeah, I want the fight, I want the fight. And then all of a sudden, back to easy work, don't belong at my level. You know, you've changed your opinion many a times. What is the truth? What do you think of me as a fighter? You say, you, I've bought all them titles. No, it's just natural progression. No. It's things are about timing. You I, don't know if you, I don't know whether you, you knew it or not. On another but level, and I've just Your promoter you at the time bought the titles off me in order to build you up in front of your crowd, your home fans. Otherwise, you, you couldn't have been boxing the Leeds Arena what at all. You bought the Commonwealth Regard, title Regardless off me. of that, I won in the, the beginning, world. I won the world. Built you I won up, the Commonwealth Ready for me to knock ball. you off. Right. But for some reason, the fight didn't happen then. Now it's happening. Well, it's happening May the 19th, yeah. we'll see. Being urged by his own corner, Selby, to keep coming forward, force the fight as a couple fly lower, left hand under right hand, looks as though they were on the belt, but the gloves come down for Ramirez, and a couple of headshots find the target from Selby. It takes a good fighter to win a world title, I've always said that. I've never said that he was a bad fighter. It takes a great fighter to keep hold of it. I've defended it four yeah, exactly, times, this is my fifth defence. It's your fifth defence, but you, you won't make, it won't be a successful one. There's been cracks, and you've talked about how I'm easy Every, every fight I got yeah, flaws. Every, 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 every fight is a The difference between me and there, any other fighter. You're in a fighter, what you I find what a way I to. Be. I always find a way to win. That's what makes the difference. I'll find a way to win. Have you, uh, this is a question for both of you, have you seen weaknesses in him, and likewise, that you think you can exploit? I see, I see weaknesses in all, all fighters, you know. Every, there isn't a perfect fighter. Of course there's weaknesses in myself, and there's, there's plenty in Josh as well. So you've analysed him, looked at him, and uh, you can see weaknesses? I, I don't analyse, but, but I know from watching, from watching boxing, every, everybody got flaws. Nobody's a perfect fighter. The closest can... to a perfect fighter, I'd say, is, is Sugar Ray Robinson. He's been beat. He's, he's a good, he's a good rounded fighter. He's got a good, good, good bit of experience behind him in those championship fights. But he haven't boxed someone like me. No one who can adapt on the night. What about you, Josh? I don't think Lee does. I don't think you do the twelve rounds. Well, you set a fast pace. Well, but maintaining that throughout, like I say, you know. How really, many, how many twelve round fights have I, uh, have I won? No, that's fine. All by unanimous uh, decision. If listen, I just stole the early of, rounds, I won't be winning by unanimous decision. None of them decision. have been as fit as I am. I, you know what I mean? None of them have been as fit as I am. I, I've got levels of uh, fitness I can go through. I even got out of second gear before. You know, when the best will come when it so needs that, to. That, 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 that's since since, me, since me winning the European title, I can I've stop you from all punches. What's that? I can stop you from home punches and using your fitness. Right, okay. With general ringcraft. Ring, general ringcraft, but you couldn't stop can, that guy I, last time. He couldn't even throw a jab and he was catching left, right, and centre. Hmm? The guy you boxed last time yeah. couldn't even throw a jab, but he still caught you. He, he, was, a, he was an undefeated fighter. He must have been half tidy. He was ranked like 50th in IBO rankings. He was an undefe undefeated fighter like yourself. He must have been half tidy. How many undefeated fighters have I beat? Maybe seven, eight? You tell me someone who's done that? I, I don't know many. Who do you think's the harder puncher? Do you think you're the sharper puncher? Neither of us are known for knockout artists, but I believe I'll punch out there. Eleven stone. You know what? On about on about your, tw you know, your claims on social media about some some guys. Some when, guy, when you walk listen, about it, and every way. No, no, no. When, I'm just saying when you you said that when you walk out every way you'd bang the clean out, but nine stone you're not a banger. So, some guy reporter said. 
Josh Warrington claims you can't punch. I said, if I hit him on the chin now, you'd be sleeping. That's what I said. And that's the truth. If I got up now and chinned you, you you'd won't be do sleeping. That. You won't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. I wouldn't do that. Don't do that. I wouldn't do it anyway. I'm a professional. I've won the world title. Yeah. Making my fifth defence. Yeah. I must be doing something right. Is you've going done to... all right, but you've just, you've just got over the line. Right. You've, you've, you've just got over the line. For me, I mean, like I say, Monty, I'll give you an hard night. And what, what I, just feel, I, just feel, I just feel like on, one, of the, one of these opponents, really, I think if you'd have messed, stepped in with any of the opponents, Oscar Valdez, uh, Leo Santa Cruz, Carl Thompson, yeah. they'll beat you. I feel it, I feel it, I I've spent hundreds of rounds, I, I rounds with Oscar Valdez. I don't think he'd think the same. You might be world champion in the gym, but being under the lights... No, 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 I, occasion, I'm world champion in real life. You might be world champion in the gym. You say no, 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 that, no, listen, listen to what I'm saying. Listen to what I'm saying. You talk about being a world class in this that work, right? You are a world champion in lights, but being like world class in this that over and you know, you're the best in the gym. Doing that, but doing it on fight night is a different kettle of fish. How many times have I done it? Defending my title five times. Yeah, and this, this, is, my what, this is what I'm trying to get to you. That I am on that level, but I'm better than them. We'll see. I'm a different level. We'll see. And we'll, I'll, I'll show well, you. We'll we go for I'll my defences. The first defence, Fernando Montiel, elite fighter. Past his yeah. best. Still an elite fighter. Something you'll never be. <laughs> Ask anybody about Eric Hunter in America. Great amateur, outstanding amateur. Brilliant amateur, but amateurs good, amateurs. Good fighter as a professional. Amateurs, amateurs. A good fighter as a professional. But not Who's the next defence? Jonathan Victor Barros. Former world champion. Made Very plenty of defences. Better fighter than you. <laughs> I'd beat any of them fighters. Even the guy I, I won the title of off, Evgeny Gradovich. And I won't get put on my backside. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm 100% positive I won't get put on my sure? backside, yeah. You talk about you talk about your big, uh, you've got a big solid chin and you spout with these um, light middles and this and other, but why not put you on your backside easily? I've been shot. walked. Have you, yeah, have you ever seen a fight it. where I've Look been walked? Look at Muhammad Ali. Did he get put on his ass? Yes. And what did he do? Get up and win the fight. Talking, what did I do? Talking, the same thing. We're talking about heavyweights. We're talking about heavyweights. I did the same thing. Got put down. Got up. Won the fight. Comfortable. And you? You're just another defence. We'll see, we'll no, another defence. We'll see. Nothing special. There's the possibility after this of Carl Frampton in Belfast. That's the one they're talking about. I know your eyes at the moment on this one, but how much would you, if you come through this, how much would you welcome that? Well, when I beat Josh, that would be the next one I'm looking at. And what about you, Josh? Listen, I think uh, me and Carl, it'd be a bigger fight than what Lee is. Obviously, he's not known uh, really with his fan base and whatnot. He's not really, he don't really appeal to anybody, you know. Um, you know, they don't like banging door to watch him. I don't think he's the most entertaining, so yeah. No, but I'm the best. Going on to... You're trying to sell us a fight this way, so chill out. I am trying to sell a fight. I'm chill just out. saying, I'm just telling people what they just want to do. Just turn up May the 19th. I, I will take, take a beating 19, like the rest yeah. of my opponents and take a be happy beating. with that. See, that's, that's a cockiness. You, you don't know what you are. You come here, you start to I know I'm better humble. than you. I know really? I'm better than you. I'm we'll, very humble. We'll see you on May 19th. Humble. Listen, you are going to be able to that. You're bumping your guns. You're that when I'm catching you clean. Catching you clean and non stop. That one's not going to stop. In the closing stages, big right hand again from Martinez. Thugs home into the body of Josh Warrington. It's been a good, good round for the Spaniard, this one. But is it too late? He's won round 12, but has he won the fight? We come now to the final bell of what was an excellent fight. To the winner, by majority decision. And still, the WBC International Federal Champion, from Leeds, Josh Warrington! I watched it against people my team, You watched it, yeah. When I Ryan Twitcher. I was supposed to man him for When Ryan Twitcher. Boxed, boxed it one hand, never been a, Yeah. Never been on canvas. Oh. Okay. When Ryan Twitcher against people my team, that's what happened when me and people my team is smart. Let's go. Oh, I will do. I'll give him a call, right? What are you going to feel when you walk out of the dressing room? See this man who you say has been obsessed with you for the last two or three years, and you hear that deafening support. I'll How's be that going to be? I feel the same as I am now. Cool, calm and collected. Go out with a sharp head. You want cool, head, calm and collected and at press conference? Why, 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 you, why you think them couple of, the, couple of guys <laughs> you do anything? Don't be did, you see, did you see your face? Don't be silly. Did you see your face? Again, you're trying to sell a fight. This whole story. Oh, this whole mate, I'm just letting you know. 
you're coming here with cocky, with a big belief that you're just going to be in, it's going to be an easy life. It's going to be here, but it's easy not. work. Just chill out. See, see, see we'll get here, John. From, from first defense. on, he's, he's gone already. His box has gone already. From this first start interview, he was saying to me, oh, it's going to be a tough fight, it's going to be a decent fight, Josh. Now he's going to try and build the fight. I, mean. I can't let the fans know it's going to be a mismatch, can I? <sighs> right, selling the fight, are you? Stop selling the fight, chill out. So you don't think it's going to be a mismatch? He doesn't even I, know I what believe I'm going to win the fight comfortable, just like the rest of my fights. I believe either a unanimous decision or a late stoppage. Comfortable? Them, like, them last four fights weren't comfortable, mate. Well, what, was the the what was the result? What was the result? Yeah, you got, the win. You, got defense, the win, you got the win, you got the win, you got the That's win, it. but they weren't comfortable. Not Go on like you're the champion, you're just, right. just another challenger. Listen, I'm just another challenger, but we're going to take your belt off you. We wish you all the best. We hope that it's going to be a, a very special night. I hope you can fight like you talk, so. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be a great, uh, it's going to be a great atmosphere. That's Don't going to be sorry. absolutely Don't guaranteed. And uh, as the you. fight gets a little bit closer, I think they're probably going to dislike each other a little bit more. Lee? Josh, thank you very much. Can't wait. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Time in history, all four belts in the cruiserweight division will belong proudly around the waist of one man.